Today I'm talking with Brad Camp and Brad has kindly um, offered to come and be our motivational guest speaker on the 16th of June for all of our amazing marathon runners and I'm so excited to introduce him to all of you today. Um, for those who don't know, Brad has had an illustrious career as an athlete, as a runner and just a couple of quick questions. So first of all, thank you for offering to share your stories with us on the 16th of June. Um, what inspired you to become an athlete? Um, really was a, a, a selfish de decision where I was a good runner a, as a junior and, and I, I looked at saying I wanted to do something for myself and so and finishing literally the day I finished school I made the decision sat down with my coach literally that it was that day and said that I want to be better at this I want to start to uh, take the next step of senior running how are we going to get to the Olympics and that was the conversation so the next Olympics was four years time um, and we had a four-year plan we literally sat down and planned it out and it was, it was a choice, it was a change. And I didn't expect to make the Olympics straight away, but we put in a training program, uh, we looked at the way, uh, I suppose, my health was at the time, my capabilities, and let's have a plan to build up. And within six to eight months, it was a, a change. And you know, I suppose the rest is history, we made the Olympics that four years later, Commonwealth Games and a few other things. But it was just a, a literally a mind shift of, of saying, what do I want to do, what do I need to do, and luckily the coach, you know, he hadn't been there before, but he's, he'd had coached and, and seen a lot of different athletes come through at close to that level. Mm. And, um, and and I think what we planned for just made, made it work. Um, and I, when I say it was selfish, I really, as a, I suppose, an athlete and as a person, you really got to be selfish in what you do, but you need a network of a team behind you. Uh, you need the massage, you need a good coach, you need a family to say, well, uh, put up with your bad moods and, and get you out of bed sometimes and enjoy the successes and, and help you when you go through, you know, of course, uh, when you're not not successful. And especially the injuries, because out of many of the races I've won over the years, there's 10 times more I lost. So you actually won the Gold Coast Marathon in 1989. Mm -hmm. How long did you actually hold the record for after you won in that year? Uh, it's 22 years and um, yeah, so it was... That's, that's amazing. Yeah, it was... It's it incredible. Was a, and it was one of those day, days out where I ran and just felt great on the whole day and it doesn't happen too much, it was like a runner's high or you know, people experience things in their life you have that one exhilarating and I was lucky enough to have two hours of it and, and run a good time. So That's incredible. Yeah. It's such a great event and such a great course as well. And yeah. for this year being the 40th anniversary, for me to have 63 people in a team is pretty amazing. Mm. Um, so Oops. I'm really excited to have you come along. Just maybe share with us what's your one, one tip while they're training at the moment that you can share with them about preparing for, some, for an event that they've never done before. Um, just believe in yourself. And, and make the time to to do the um, to do the exercise and and, and focus on uh, on your diet and, and focus on what you really want out of uh, out of life and out of, out of the mission or the um, the lifestyle change you've made. Uh, you've got a network of team with Felicity's team behind you to support you, but more more importantly, you've made the decision. You've taken that step in, inside her business to make a lifestyle change, and it's looking at that and grasping it. Um, and everyone has that opportunity in their life to do and a lot of people make the change whether it's in business. Um, you've made the, the step in, in health um, and Felicity's got a great team behind you. Um, I made this, the same step as, a, as, as an athlete and, um, and paid benefits. I wasn't the best but I gave it everything I did and got a lot of benefits from it. Chased the likes of Montegetti and Deke for many years but that's the difference. But um, I was rewarded with um, a lot of effort I put in and that's what I think with everyone you put the effort in, you'll get the results. And you need that network, a team, but really that self-belief. Self Fantastic, well, I'm really excited to have you. 16th of June will be our pre-marathon special motivational um, breakfast with special guest Brad Camp. And we hope that we're gonna have an absolute knockout crowd show up for training that day. Looking forward to seeing you all. And thank you so much, Brad, can't wait. Thanks, Felicity. And look forward to seeing you there. Thank you. Thank you.